Hi everybody, I am back again with my dumpster dive unboxing slash haul. And as usual, I'm always really happy when I actually find something these days because um, it's been kind of scarce where I'm at lately. So um, I checked a couple other um, places, but they really didn't have anything. So I got all these at, at one location at um, Five Below. And I was pretty happy. Um, so I guess um, I'll just go ahead and get started so I can share. Um, first, there was this box just kind of laying in there, sitting in there. So I pulled it out and there's um, a bunch of wall posters. And they're really nice. Um, some, for example, is um, the Beatles, Abbey Road, Detroit Lions, Nightmare on Elm Street. Um, I see NASA. There's um, How to Train Your Dragon 3. So those are all really cute. They're like for kids. Um, and they're all brand new. And um, they're like uh, your standard size poster. Um, there is this one. It's kind of bent. But I think it's still usable. Um, it says, I think this is a baseball one. So like there's the Blue Jays. And I think some re <coughs> Red Sox and um, stuff like that. So... Um, so there's that. Yeah, it says MLB logos right there on, on it. <clears throat> so, yes, that wasn't too bad. Um, I think I could find somebody who might want some of these. Um, so I'm pretty happy about that. Next, this is like a unboxing slash um, haul. Because um, I seen that this box was just full of um, snacks and chocolate and candy and but I don't know exactly how many are in there yet um there I did look at the expiration date um they're like a month past the not the expiration date but the best buy freshness guarantee from the from the company date and sometimes there's also um like they expire in a month but they just throw it off they get off the shelves and just throw them out because there's only a month left on them so, um, like, for example, there's these, which are really good. They're, like, dark chocolate, and they come in coconut and um, other um, flavors, such as, like, this one's peanut, these bark fins, and um, they're fair trade, non-GMO, and there are several of these bags in there. Um, like, for example, this one's best by date was 12 um, 19, excuse me, 2019, so they just passed their freshness date, it's, it's still the beginning of January here, um, and there's also, like, toffee pretzels, and, um, mm, excuse me, my voice is going out, I have, like, a sore throat, um, Hershey's, uh, caramel chocolate, there is these, are these, um, Oatmeal raisin cookies, like bakery style. Here's some sour punch straws. I love these. They're like my absolute favorite. Um, and they're the just they just go down and down. I have to count them and see how many is actually in here because I really there's just a ton in here. They just threw everything out. Um, raspberry Ghirardelli dark chocolate squares and these are like my favorite favorite these and the um, caramel so um, yeah um, let's see what else there is in here um, there's mint and also excuse me there's um, oh here's some like fruit um, organic Banana, mango, and pineapple. And there's like nothing added to this. So that's like a healthy snack. Nice, um, healthy sweets snack. Um, there's also a hatch animals in here. Um, oh, it looks like it's a Christmas ornament. I didn't really notice until now. Um, so yeah, there's an entire box of blueberry fig bars. And these are like the healthier type of a snack um the best buy date on these is um i think it says 919 
So these might be a little bit older. I am not sure. Um, wait, what does it say here? It says, um, Best Buy 913.19. That's what it says. So, um, they, they're kind of older, so they might be good still or might not. I'm not sure. So, maybe, like, the older stuff like that I might just get rid of. But the rest of the stuff, they should still be pretty good. So there's that there. Um, I have not been down in this box yet. I just pretty much pulled everything out. So, yeah, there's all that there. Um... Here's some more mint. Um, there's more of these um, toffee pretzels. And it just goes all the way down. Mostly, I think, are these um, pretzels down at the bottom. So, that's pretty good. These are like some free snacks. I am I can give these away to people. Um, I could do a lot with these for sure. So I'm I'm happy with this. I'm I'm pretty pleased because lately it's in my area it's been kind of tough to really find anything. So I'm really happy about that. I will move on now. Um, I got this bag and please pardon all the garbage that's mixed in with it. Um, it is a garbage bag. This is what they throw out of the store. Um, so there will be stuff in there mixed in, but. Uh, please just um, don't mind that. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Okay, so to avoid all the crinkling sound, I paused it just to unknot, untie the knot of the top of the bag. So I will just go ahead and dive right in and see what we have. So looks like, okay, so there's some garbage. Okay, that's to be expected. Um, the first thing I think that I am able to find is, um, a pair of these black glitter s slippers for ladies, and they are really nice. Um, size 8, 9, large. Um, they still do have the tag on them and everything, and, um, the bottoms are okay. They don't look like, um, they're slashed or anything like that, which some stores do. Um, I've noticed after they caught on, um, maybe they noticed the bags missing. Maybe they noticed my car always there. But they started um, just cutting everything. Um, before, it used, I used to come home with like five of these bags a day from Dollar Tree and Bed Bath and & Beyond and Bath and & Body Works and all these other stores. But it's just been kind of tough lately, so... Um, yeah, so that's the story. I think I say that in my, all my videos, but I always say that because just in case there's any new viewers. So, um, the next item I think I have here are these, another pair of these fuzzy pink, um, lady slippers. And they're really nice. They say size 7, 8, medium. And they don't have food or drink on them, which it isn't a garbage bag, so it could get spilt. But I don't see any to anything on there, so they seem really really nice. Um, so there's that. Um, here's a box for some um, Bluetooth earbuds, and I'm hoping that they fell out in this bag. I'll have to see. Um, here are a brand new pair of gloves, ladies' gloves. They could probably fit anybody because they're like kind of big. So that's great because you rather have them bigger than too small, you know? Um, and they are brand new and they don't seem to have any damage on them. I think that someone just pulled them apart and threw them or something and they just like clean it off and threw in the garbage bag or something. <laughs> that's what it seems like at least. Um, but yeah, there's that there. Here is a letter S, I believe, Christmas ornament in gold. Yeah. Monogram. So this is really cute. There's that. Um, um, oh, here we go. There are a pair of these Bluetooth earbuds, and I'm just hoping that they work. I really like these a lot. I have never had a problem with them connecting to my phones. And I say phones because I've tried them with different phones that I've had. And they connect Bluetooth-wise um, 
flawlessly. So these are really great and they're only five bucks. So they're, they're pretty awesome. Here is a monogram R and gold Christmas ornament. So that's, that's pretty cute there. Here is a screen protector for an iPhone 11. Here is a micro USB six foot charger cable. And it's, it's this one, I don't even think this one was even open. Like they have the open ones because they're store returns. Um, it might have been open. Yeah, this one was open, but they throw out ones that have the stickers and the packaging has never even been disturbed, so. Next up we have, um, oh, this is an empty box, but it looks like it's this here which is a portable speaker. And um, I, I don't see like food spilt on it or candy stuck to it or coffee spilt on it or anything like that. So it looks like it's in really good condition and it's like, um, like a copper, it's kind of like a nice copper color. I don't know if the camera's picking up the color or not, but it's it looks really good. It, it feels brand new. Um, and these are good. They're um, battery powered and um, <clears throat> they have a 3.5 millimeter jack right there, auxiliary cable. <clears throat> and um, you just plug it into an MP3 player or phone or whatever and you could just carry it around with you everywhere. So those are really nice. And let's see, next we have another pair of slippers, lady slippers. and. They are a size 1011, and they're glittery and black, and I don't know how if the camera's picking up how nice they are or not, but they are really, really nice. They're really decent. They have the price tag still stuck on them, and they're just like in really great condition. So I got those there. I'm really happy because I used to get these every day because um, to my surprise no one um really had goes dumpster diving and the stores really didn't know and they caught on somehow so they have been like wary of throwing out anything <laughs> so it's been really hard um lately um so this is really great i'm really happy today here are another pair in size six seven small and i'm looking um they yeah, they have like this um, cardboard packaging inside to kind of hold them up. And they are in great shape. I don't see anything wrong with them. So there's the, um, that there. Um, next, there is a speaker. Let's see, I don't know. Um, it looks like, it appears to be a... Um, maybe a micro USB powered um, speaker because there's um, that there unless that's just the battery it could be Bluetooth too I am not sure but it's really cute it's the same color as that last speaker it's like a coppery color and there is like nothing wrong with it I don't see anything really wrong with it and um, it's really great it's portable you can take it with you and just kind of have it and it's really nice and that's a cute style um next there's like this keyboard um I think you plug this in it's oh it's a portable keyboard and you can plug it in via you um, micro USB cable and you can just use the um, keys like this and just type however you want to type and it'll type for you and that's pretty good here's a caps lock button right there and yeah that's pretty nice so there's that there um here is a um light strip um right here but i am i don't know if this one works these are they're good, but they're not so good. I've heard, I've had these and they've worked for continuously for probably a year. And then other ones, they just don't work at all. So they're kind of like, if you're lucky to find 
a good one, then they, yeah, they're, then they work really good, but otherwise they're, um, they, they are non-working. So I'll have to check this and see what's going on with that. <clears throat> Next is a chess set, and that's really nice. Oh, I'm sorry, that's in French. Okay, there we go, English. Um, yeah, made of wood, so that's good. Real wood material there. You got a game board and 32 game pieces with instructions, so that's pretty nice. It looks like it's still in all the box, the packaging and everything, so that's not too bad right there. Yeah, pretty good. Um, next up are another pair of earbuds, Bluetooth. I'll have to check these and make sure that they work. I'm just hoping that they do. Sometimes they don't. They, they're really broke. They won't connect to the phone or any other Bluetooth device. And they just, yeah, they just toss them. So, yeah. Um, I've had that happen where they all were broke. <laughs> but sometimes, you know, you find the good ones too. So, um, yeah, you got to look a lot of times. Um, like right here is underneath all this garbage trash or whatever is like a really cute bracelet and it has like a um like a teardrop um crystal in it and it's so small it gets kind of lost but you know that's still really good it's got it's brand new there's no nothing wrong with it really and you could just absolutely like gift this or use it for yourself and it's really nice and if just if I would use it, I would really enjoy it. It's not bad at all. It's really cute. So there's that there. And a hair scrunchie, which is brand new. Um, it's really super clean and really brand new. It's like a velvety material and <clears throat> and really nice. So yeah, not bad. There is a penny. I forgot to mention, they throw out money. Um People drop money throughout the store, and they, I think they sweep it or vac it and just toss it. So there is a penny penny here. I have found uh, bigger change, like quarters, dimes, nickels, um, all throughout the bag. You just got to dig and look for the little stuff. So if you're getting tips on my video on how to do this, make sure you check everything because a lot of times there's money. Um, so there's that there. It's only a penny that time, but I found, um, like, where there was, like, you know, maybe, like, almost a dollar in there. <laughs> a few quarters and some pennies and stuff, so, yeah. Um, there's a keychain, and you squeeze it, and their eyes pop out like that. <laughs> and it's really cute. It's very clean. Um, a lot of times you'll find these, um, and the bag is really messy, um, and you just got to clean everything off. Um, but this this one here, like, especially the small stuff gets buried in, in vacuum dust and coffee and pop. But, you know, I'm glad this thing made it. It's really clean and and it's good. It's like a, I think it's a Boston Terrier dog or something like this. That's cute. Here is another S ornament. Um, it's missing the top, but maybe I can fix it. Here is a star keychain. Um, it's like sequins on one side and like a plush, soft, very soft material on the other. And I think it changes color. Yeah, it does. Um, you just kind of push the sequins around like that and it'll change from gold to black. So there's that there. Really cute. Um, next here is... Um, <clears throat> A monogram tee. So that's really cute. This one is a perfect shape because it's ready to hang. You just put a ornament hook on there and hook it right up to your Christmas tree. So it's really cute. Um, um, yeah, so let's see here. Oh, these are good. Um, there are a pair of cat whisker and ear slippers and these are cute for like kids um they have like 
the little rhinestone nose on them and they're really fuzzy and furry and cozy and warm and they are they appear to be like really brand new they're um, tagged together still and they're just, there's the tag right there um, size small six seven and they look like they're in really great shape they have glitter on them but that's just from like Christmas ornaments or something but other than that um, that could just be dusted off other than that they are in great shape so there's that there um, here's another tea ornament um, here is a uh, Apple charger cable 10 foot Oh wow, it looks like a pair of pants, like joggers. Um, they are extra large size, and I think they're ladies. They do carry men's clothes too, but I think these are ladies' pants. But yeah, those are really great, size extra large. Um, they're cotton material. The, the waistband ties is adjustable, so it has an adjustable fit. And there's like the ankle, so they like have ankles. And they are in great shape. I don't see anything wrong with them. They must have been a store return or something. So that's really great there. I'm really happy about that one. There is a pack of Tylenol. Extra strength. And it's sealed. It's never been open. And the expiration date is 1122. So they are still um, unexpired. And that's really great because these, you know, are great to carry around in your purse. It's like the travel container. So, yeah, that's really great there. Ten caplets. Um, next is... Here's some um, the top to one of the ornaments that fell out. So, I probably would be able to fix or repair one of them. So, that's ready to hang. Um... Here is an R monogram Christmas ornament, and this one is perfect. It's like never even been removed from the packaging yet, so that one's great. That one's awesome. Um, here's like st like store paperwork, and I never mess with anything like receipts or nothing like that because it's not worth trying to do anything further than to just get the um, useful stuff um, that they throw out the garbage. Um, I've heard stories like people might try to look up um, like to try to scam the store basically. I don't know how they do it but they figure it out and I never ever do that. That's one thing that I just forbid myself to do is to try to figure out how to scam the store. So the, the, the office paper doesn't mean anything to me. And that goes for, like, all the stores. Um, if there is a gift card in here, I might try to check it. But I've never seen not even one penny on a gift card. So, um, I might, like, check a gift card balance to see if, like, they, you know, someone was like, here, just just keep, this, keep the rest or throw the rest out. You know, and there might be, like, 23 cents on there, for example. And then you can just use it. But I've never, in my life have found anything like that so I don't even do that anymore okay so next moving on next is a pair of uh, gray and black fuzzy slippers and these are size medium six and a half to seven and a half and um they still have the tag they're still perfect they're really like soft and plush um and they don't have like ripped toes or nothing like that sometimes they can be like that but I don't see any um and these are just really great so there's that there um here is a type C charger cable um it looks like it's three and a half feet so that's really great it looks like it's in good shape how we'll have to check Next we have nail dryer, and I just love these. Um, I have a few cans now, so I'm like really stocked up and I'm happy about that. So now I can like paint my nails like twice a day and I won't have to worry about like drying them because this, you know, I could just use this to 
dry my nails off and fix my nails. Um, and next is there's a three foot um, Apple charger cable. Um, here are another pair of the gray and black slippers, fuzzy, size medium six and a half to seven and a half. And there is nothing wrong with these. Um, they have the tags still attached to them, and they are just in great shape. Here is a car charger. Um, it's like pink and gold, and looks very Barbie and very cute. And I just wonder if it lights up. I like the ones that light up. If not, it's still really good. Um, because I like having that illumination. I can kind of see at night and stuff like that. So there's that. There's that there. Here's another ornament um, thing that fell off, and I might be able to fix. Um, there's um, here is a phone case or part of a phone case. Okay, rounding, getting to the last of it. Um, here is oh, this is the 3.5 millimeter jack to the uh, portable speaker. It comes with it, so there's that part to it there. Here is the um, micro USB cable for the um, little speaker. I believe it's it goes to the speaker right here. So there's that there. Um, here is another can of nail dryer. Um, the cap is, is damaged so they throw it out. But it feels full, feeling it, and it just, it feels very full. Oh, here's the box to the car charger. This, there it is right there. A tube of Carmex lip balm. Um, I don't know if it's been used or tested on, like, on a finger or anything like that. <laughs> but I'll have to see. Here is a Toy Story 4 bath bomb, and I love these. Um, I you get, uh, use these for my kids. Um, it just makes bath time a lot more funner. Um, it's fizzy and bubbly, and it makes like fun colors like red, blue, and green and all that, so it's really cute. Here is another screen protector for a um, iPhone 11 Pro Max or XS Max. And it's brand new. I think this this one is um, really really new. Um, there's something in this bag, so I'm just gonna check it out. Oh, and it's um it's one of these Apple um, uh, connectors um, for Apple. It looks like they just uh, brought it back to the store. There are a bunch of Pez candies. Um, there might be a Pez dispenser in here. Oh, here's another one. <laughs> There's that. Um, next we have a Bluetooth adapter um, set. You just uh, connect to your de uh, Bluetooth devices and it'll um, uh, connect how you need it via 3.5 millimeter port. There is another tube of Carmex lip balm. I, I'll just check for the fun. Um, is uh, tested on or new or not? And it is. I'm sorry. <laughs> Camera fall down. It is new. Um, you can see like sometimes you can see like smears or just a tiny like imperfection and you know that it's been tested on but I can't it looks like immaculate clean and never been touched so I think this this particular tube is good okay <laughs> I'm sorry I had to do that but I just wanted I just wanted to check it real quick so that one's brand new here's the box to the those um LED, the LED light strip and it looks like it's just in blue sometimes they have um like a multi-color 
and um, it's it goes to the sound and the ones I haven't found one that works that that flashes to the sound um, they don't work as good as the um, remote controlled uh, power um, controlled so um, I'll have to see though maybe it maybe it does <clears throat> I found I have a um, um, spa life electronic ionic face and neck beauty tool so wow that's really good face and neck therapy so yeah powered brush um to um brush your face um and yeah this is really good battery powered i bet yeah um yeah i think so um and it's should be in there i'm just gonna check yeah it's in here i'm just gonna try to open it yeah, there it is right there, and I'm going to just check to see if it works. So there's that. Um, and next, sorry for the crinkling sound. Here's a toy super ball, the bouncy super ball. You just can bounce these. They bounce really well. So there's that. It's brand new. Give that to some kids. Oh, next we have a pair of slippers, and these are probably a return, but hey, they're still in great condition, I think. I will check them out. Um, let's see. Um, actually, they might have been returned, but they are actually still, they're connected together still, like, from their packaging, so, um, I don't know, maybe they weren't picked up. They, no, well, actually, no, they weren't. This, they, usually how when they, um put them together that way you know someone's returning them but they're not really returns they're a size 9 10 and they're really soft and the, the soles are really foamy and squishy so they're they seem to be like they would be a very comfortable pair of lady slippers so really nice yeah um sherpa lion